Down for seven, Chief Meteorologist Mike Nelson joins us now. Mike, it's clear now, but we could see a little bit of snow in the metro for zoo lights tomorrow evening. Uh, we're going to see some colder air come in, a little bit of snow, not very much. I'll be out at Zoo Lights on Friday night uh, to light up everything for the annual festival, and we'll see uh, some pretty nice conditions by then. For this evening, clear skies, a bright moon, and the temperatures dropping to about 32 by 11 p.m. Today, on this last day of November, 57 was the high. The average is 46. Records are 73 and 10 below, both back in the 19th century. Right now, it's 53 at the airport, 46 degrees out at DIA, and the pressure's falling slightly with south winds at 13. Here are your headlines. Clear early tonight. Windy and colder tomorrow. Some periods of light snow came in. Not going to be a big deal and it will turn warmer again by the weekend. So this is what's going to turn it colder. There's a front off to the north of us, but it's coming down from Canada where there's uh, not a lot of moisture for it to work with. So it's going to bring some chilly temperatures, but the snow is going to be pretty minor with this system. Right now, the skies are clear. We'll have a big bright moon rising up and it'll be a pretty evening. Temperatures 27 by morning for Denver, 26 Greeley, 28 at Fort Collins, 10 at Leadville, 5 at Gunnison, mostly teens in the mountains and 20s to low 30s. 30s expected on the plains, but we'll start with some clouds around, a little light snow in the mountains as that front will have passed by. Snow showers by midday, again, not a big deal, and we'll see more of that in the afternoon into the evening, but this is not even a storm, really, it's just a cool down. 38 will be the high in Denver, 39, Greeley 40, Fort Collins, Colorado Springs, but a chilly 17 up at Leadville, some cold air up in the mountains. So if you're heading up that way, be prepared for that. Along the front range tomorrow, instead of upper 50s, it'll be upper 30s to low 40s. So tonight, clear early, then increasing clouds, 27 for a low temperature. For tomorrow, windy, colder, some flurries develop, a high of only 38, gusty winds, from the north, but this is what it's looking like as far as snowfall through Wednesday. We're talking less than an inch on the plains and one to three expected up in the mountains. So this is what it looks like Wednesday afternoon. The storm starting to move out of here. Mild and dry air coming back from the west. And by the time we get to Friday, mild and dry conditions have returned and you'll see it on the seven day. Tomorrow is chilly, only 38, even colder Wednesday, just 28. Look at those morning lows in the teens. By Thursday, back to 40, by Friday, 53, and over the weekend, upper 50s to around 60 degrees under mostly sunny skies. So December starts with a bit of a burr, but that first weekend is going to be mild and dry.